my fair classic 1k 13.56 megahertz key fobs this is how they look these are the colors we offer different suppliers may have different colors and um, you have to be careful when you buy tags because um, uh, as you can see on the outside they look exactly the same but this is a low frequency tag and this is a high frequency tag so this system is using high frequency tags and um, as you can see with the low frequency nothing happens uh, but if we use the high frequency this is a default blank tag you can see the uh, relay is registering it uh, but of course the system doesn't recognize it because it's not uh, pre-programmed so this tag is was, was already pre-programmed for the system and the system will recognize it when signing in or signing out in this particular case they can be used for time attending solutions vending machines door locks for example here i have a door lock a electronic door lock that uh, uh, of this kind uh, and um, uh, this particular one um, recognizes um, high frequency tags you just scan it here and it can activate the lock um, now what um, what is useful is uh, on your phone you can uh, use the tool called NFC tools um, and if, you, if your phone supports uh, NFC tags high frequency uh, you can go to other read memory and if I read it with the phone it will just read the content of the tag and um, just very very quickly how this is organized if you're curious the memory inside the tag is uh, separated um, in, in different sectors uh, um, and each sector contains four blocks so this is one sector uh, there are 16 of these on, the, on these particular tags because they are one one k um, so 16 sector, sectors and each sector has four blocks and the uh, last block contains uh, security information uh, by default there are security keys here but if you change these keys uh, then only you can read it back uh, because only uh, only program that knows these keys can read the information from this uh, particular sector you can um, encrypt the different sectors with different keys if you wish uh, so this is how it's uh, used uh, a little bit of information for developers and uh, when we send them we usually seal them with um, uh, in, in, in bags like these uh, because these uh, uh, aluminium foil bags so they don't um, get accidentally used uh, for example if we put the tag on top of the bag uh, if, the, if we put the bag in between the tag and the reader you can see it doesn't register like that it reads it but if there's a bag it doesn't I hope you like the review. These tags are available for purchase on the link underneath.